slime using famous YouTuber Justabira Slime Tori Magical Clay. So yeah. On screen are today's shout outs. If you guys also like a shout out, just subscribe, turn notifications on, and be the first 20 people to comment hashtag notification squad on my video. So basically how this is gonna work is I'm gonna take an LOL OMG doll and recreate her head into slime. But I have to use just Amira's slime toy magical clay to recreate it. Yeah. I am really, really excited to do this because the OMG doll that I chose is so pretty. Like she's really pretty. So I'm really excited. Yeah, now let's start. So here she is. So here's the OMG doll that I'll be recreating. She is beautiful. So basically, this is her hair. Okay, her hair is literally just pure beauty. Like it's, just a look at this. It's like a, a light lavender, it's like a light purple color, almost like lavender. With these super, super pretty metallic like streaks in there, which looks absolutely beautiful. And she has this, this is her face. Her lips are gorgeous, they're super sparkly, and her eyeshadow, if you can see. And here's her outfit. I'll be only recreating her head, so I'll be also recreating her beautiful buns that she has on top. And she also has this like beautiful collar right here, if you guys can see that. Like, it's absolutely insane. It's so pretty. She has this pretty skirt that even has like a mini pocket, and her hands are literally just a bomb not bomb. Like, look at this. They're literally so like, they look exactly like human hands. Her nail, and she even has like a ring on the other. Guys, I'm not an expert in dolls, so I don't know much. By the way, Kitty K, her name right here, came with this like little mag music magazine. Here, it says, Hair Toss Mic Check Meow, because her name is Kitty K, so. She also came with these beautiful ears, and they're like super metallic-y and like nice. I love them. Kind of reminds me of Just Amira. By the way, all the clay that I'm using in the video is actually, like almost all of the clay that I'm using in the video is just, just Amira's Slime Tory Magical Clay. And she also has these glasses, AK, and this super adorable microphone, like look at that. On the handle, it literally says meow. Like, how cute is that? Like, guys, this is just adorable. Okay, so now let's start recreating this beauty. Create the OMG doll, I'll be using mostly clay, but also some basic slime. So here it is, it's my ASMR. So as you can tell, the slime is super, super clicky. And the gloss, it's so glossy. And it's in so insanely stretchy. It makes amazing bubble pops. And this is just the basic slime. The recipe is just the Elmer School white glue with some lotion, of course, and activator. By the way, the name of the OMG doll is Kitty K. And if you wanna buy, if you wanna buy her, the link to her on Amazon is in the description box down below. So here is gonna be the face. I know it's not, it's of course not the exact color of Kitty's face, but I think it's actually pretty close because guys, I've literally spent hours trying to find a good color that matches her and making it. I've added, I added like a, some of paints into here to try to make it look like her skin color. Took me like about 30 minutes to find this clay. So yeah, okay. Anyway, now we're just gonna roll this into a ball and make the head. And now we're just gonna flatten it. So here is how the head looks once I'm done making it. I think it looks pretty on point. The color isn't the best, but it's still pretty nice. So now we are going to be doing the face and we're gonna do the eyes first. Okay guys, I'm done making the eyes. You can see, cause she has the first layer of white, brown, then black. And then I'm going to put on the brown and then the black. Okay, I'm done making the first eye and now I'm just need the black part. Okay 
you guys, I'm done making the eyes. Here's how they look. I think they look really, really nice. By the way, I added like, you know, those eyelashes to make the eyes look exactly like kitties. Okay, so now we're gonna try to put them on. I really don't wanna ruin the eye though. Okay guys, so here are the eyes once I'm done making it. I think they're a little bit too big, but I guess that's the whole point of the OMG doll. So I think they're pretty good. Okay, so now we're just gonna do the mouth, right? So here's how she looks so far, pretty nice. But if you can already tell, like the whole point of the OMG doll is actually their face and the hair. And I have this clay. So basically how this is gonna work is I'm gonna obviously shape the mouth out of this. Then I have this very fine, I think it's called iridescent glitter. This iridescent glitter and it's the exact color for sparkles, which I found really, really cool and very good because I'm just gonna make this and then cover it with this glitter. Okay, so now let's start shaping. Guys, I don't know, I tried making the mouth, like this is, the mouth is actually probably the hardest part. Like, I don't really know. It's, I think it's pretty good. Again, it doesn't look like it yet because I didn't put the glitter over it, but let's just like hope for the best because the mouth is like really, really hard. Okay guys, so I apparently made the mouth, but I completely forgot that this is such like fragile glitter that one blow just makes it like fly everywhere as you can see. But thankfully, since it's so light, I can just take this and wipe it off, I think. Oh my gosh, I almost ruined it. Okay, anyway, so here's the mouth. I think it actually turned out pretty nice. It's not bad, but it's not the best. Okay guys, so now for the eyeshadow, um, I'm just gonna take the glitter that I have on the table and just put it on next to the eyelashes. So hopefully it will turn out good. Here's actually the camera comparison before we start doing the hair. Comparison. I think it looks, I'm gonna rate the face right now an eight out of 10, just because the mouth looks a little weird and the eyes are kind of crooked. But overall, I think the face is not that bad. And yeah, anyways, now let's start doing the hair. So, as you can see that she has these buns and the bangs are literally almost touching the eyes. Like you can see. So, basically, I'm, I took, I already separated this. This part is going to be the bangs. This, like about this. And this part is gonna be the, the ponytail. Can do this. So we hear how the bangs look after I'm done making them. Um, I just realized that it's kind of dark, but it's okay. So now we're just gonna do the ponytail part. And now we're gonna do the other side. Okay guys, so here's how it looks for now. You might think to yourself saying like, um, this looks disgusting. Ew, I hate it. That's because we're not done yet. I think this actually looks really nice. Like, for now, of course. Okay, so since I'm done making, like, the two ponytails, now all I have left to do is just those two streaks that come down um, on her, like, cheeks. So she, in the back, she has a lot of hair. I don't think I'm gonna do that, because if I do do that, like, you won't really see the ponytails, because this is just, like, clay. So you won't see them. So I think I'm just gonna do these streaks that she has right here. Okay guys, so here is how my creation looks of her head. I think it actually looks pretty nice. And I'm actually all done, but the last thing I need to do is just cover the hair in glitter because you know, the most special thing about Kitty K is her metallic like streaks in her hair. So, for the glitters, I got some silver glitter, this giant silver, and some gold. So now we are just going to 
Sprinkle that on top and hope to not add a lot. Okay, y'all. Hey guys, so I don't think it looks the best. The glitter is like too big. So I got these, this glitter right here is like small. This is like kind of like iridescent glitter a little bit. Yes, that looks much better. Cause these are, these glitters right here, they're kind of like for crafts more. So they're kind of like big. Guys, this looks gorgeous. I think this looks beautiful. I managed to get all like the glitter, most of the glitter off of the sides. So it looks like it's only on the hair. I think this looks gorgeous. Guys, I think this looks really, really pretty. Comment down below your thoughts. Okay guys, so here's the final result of my recreation of Kitty K, the OMG doll. Here is the comparison. And guys, now I'm just starting to realize that the color of the hair is literally on point. So make sure to go comment down below your ratings and thoughts and how well I recreated her. Like right now, pause the video. Personally, I'm gonna rate it a like nine, nine out of 10, just because I don't know, just the hair is a little bit wonky to me. But overall, I think it looks really nice. The eyes, I really, really like the eyes. And also, the mouth isn't the prettiest, but I just I just really like the face of it. So make sure to go comment down below your thoughts. And yeah, now for the most satisfying part, we're just gonna mix this all together. So turn your volume up, sit back, relax, and enjoy the satisfaction of ASMR. Okay guys, so here's the slime once I finished mixing it all together. So it turned out to be really, really, really stiff, even stiffer than like last time I made a gotcha character and okay. 
honestly the color i can't really tell the color right now but it looks to be kind of like a gray brown color which i'm definitely not a fan of but i think it was pretty satisfying to mix in comment down below how satisfying you think it was or maybe my satisfactions sucked and i need to work on it it doesn't really make such great swirls and again it's very stiff i can barely stretch it doesn't really it doesn't really make any bubble pops it honestly has like so much clay in here that it doesn't even spread it has like barely any bubble pops like you just see i can i can technically make a bubble pop but it's not loud <laughs> and it's definitely not fun to play with okay so as you can see it turned into like a grayish brown color yeah definitely not a fan of it and i don't really like it but I really liked how it looked marble and I think it just looks really, I think it looked really pretty because now it doesn't. And there's like these little chunks in here. It's because of the clay that kind of happens to like every single clay slime. So that's completely understandable. But it's also very hard to poke and like play with it and you could do ASMR with it. So my ASMR might be a little cringe right now. I'm going to rate the end product a 2.5 out of 10 for me. I'm just giving it a 2.5 out of 10 because the texture sucks it looks really really bad and you cannot do any asmr with it it's very stiff you can't even play with it so fortunately i gave it i gave this a 2.5 out of 10 but the slot the, i'm gonna rate my my satisfaction of me like you know just mixing this all together i'm gonna rate it like a 9 out of 10 i think it was pretty good so yeah, comment down below if you want me to do a part two on this. And if you want me to recreate more OMG dolls and tell me what other OMG dolls to, for me to recreate. Like, subscribe, but if you want to, bye!